Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another video for you guys today. And today's video is going to be things that you can do on your MacBook Air. So before we get on to the video, don't forget to give it a humongous thumbs up and subscribe because why not? Okay, so before we get on to the things you can actually do with your MacBook Air, I just wanted to explain to some people that when you have a MacBook Air, a lot of people think that you're gonna be like, oh, I'm never gonna get off of it. Like, I'm always gonna be on it. But that's not true. My friend can tell you, she was dying to have a MacBook and she was like, oh my God, I can't believe you're not on your MacBook. If I had a MacBook, I'd be on there all the time. And so she got a MacBook and then she's like, there's not really much to do on here. <laughs> so I'm gonna give you guys a few ideas on what to do on your MacBook Air so you guys can be more creative with it and be productive with your MacBook. Let's go on to the things you can do on your MacBook. Okay, so the first thing you can do on your MacBook Air is edit. Um, if you guys don't know, MacBooks, come with iMovie and iMovie is a great app for if you're just starting out on editing and even I use it today and I've still been editing for a while now. It's super easy to use and I think it's great if you have a MacBook you should definitely try editing on this if you guys have a YouTube channel or even if you're just editing a montage or something whatever you want it's great for editing and I actually have a video on how I edit on iMovie so if you guys want to check that out link in the description. The next thing you can do on your MacBook Air is play games because, I mean, who doesn't want to play games every once in a while? Um, there's a lot of games in the App Store that you can download, but you guys aren't limited to just the App Store. You guys can go on any website that has games, but beware of viruses. Don't download anything that doesn't look good, that looks sketchy. Don't download. I recommend going on, on websites that you can play games on without having to download anything, aka Cool math game. We've all played this one time in our lives as kids. I still play it every once in a while, so you guys should definitely try cool math out. This one's not as fun and great as the other ones, but it's school. Um, we all go to school, maybe you go to college, I don't know, but this is great for all uses on school. You can take notes, you can do research, um, you can do presentations. This is Keynote, it's pretty much like um, a presentation app where you can make your own presentations. It comes with a bunch of templates that you can use to make your own. And I think that's just really great and super easy. Next thing on the list is obviously YouTube. You have to watch YouTube, dude. If you're watching this video, then obviously you watch YouTube. There's lots of great videos on the internet. I definitely recommend Logan Paul Vlogs. Ooh, <laughs> what am I saying? Um, but yeah, there's a lot of great videos on YouTube, so watch YouTube. I mean, but don't spend all your time on YouTube. I'm guilty. The next thing on this list is social media. As if your phone is not enough, there's also social media for your computer. So let's say your phone's dead. You can do it on your computer. You guys should go follow me on my Instagram. It's gonna be sarah.grace34. <laughs> Always plug. And of course you can go on Facebook and Twitter and all those other stuff. I personally don't use those, but you can go on those. The next thing is music. I mean, who doesn't wanna listen to music? I don't know. But of course you can go on YouTube and listen to music and you can download Pandora, you can go to iHeartRadio, and of course Spotify, that's also, you can download it on your MacBook Air. The next thing is shopping. Who doesn't love to shop? I don't know. But you can shop on a lot of online stores. You can shop on Target. You can shop on Tart. You can shop on GameStop. You can shop on Runway. Not sponsored. Romway, sponsor me, please. But yeah, there's so many places you can shop online. Don't spend all your money. Just save your money, kids, so that way you can afford a MacBook Air. And the last thing that you can do on your MacBook Air is watch Sarah Grace. Woo! That's one of my favorites to do on my MacBook Air. I do it all the time. Okay, guys, I'm just kidding. I don't want to cheat y'all off of the last one. And the last one is one that's really creative, and I definitely recommend if you are feeling like you want to make something, and it's make music. Um, instead of just listening to music, you can make your own with GarageBand, and it comes with the MacBook, so you can download it and make tons of free music. It gives you the instruments. Everything is there. You just have to start creating. <laughs> so if you guys are interested in making music, that's a great app for it. Okay guys, that was the video. Hopefully you guys liked it and it's helpful for you guys. So if you guys have a MacBook, then you guys can make the best use of it and have fun with it. So don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up if you did like it and if it did help you and subscribe to my channel. And tell me down below which one you want to try out. Alright guys, that's all I have for you guys today and I'll see you guys next Sarah Grace Saturday.
to rock. Underneath the palm trees, you can leave your worries. Listen to the words you say you wanna get so high. You breathe me in like air tonight. Listen to the words.